Jonathan Majors begged accuser to avoid hospital, warning of possible investigation messages show. And now you go into these messages. Thing is, he, he's saying, <laughs> no, I don't, look, still don't know what happened. I'm still not clear, but he's saying things that will put in people's heads domestic abuser. Mm-hmm. Saying things like, oh, well, tell him you, you bumped your head. Uh-huh. If you don't, don't tell the doctors everything because that get me in trouble. Yeah. You know, just keep that between us. Majors 34 texted Jabari, who was 30, uh, in September 2022. They will ask you questions. And as I don't think you actually protect us, it could lead to investigation, even if you do lie and they suspect something. It goes on right here to say, in the text messages, displayed to the jury and read into the record by Jabari on her fourth and final day on the stand on Friday, Jabari had assured Majors that she would not blame him for causing an injury to her head. I will tell the doctors I bumped my head. Jabari Jabari cried. Oh, she put some tears on too. Mm -hmm. She cried as she read. Uh, She wasn't able to continue, so uh, the assistant district attorney, Kelly Galloway, took over. I will tell the doctor I bumped my head if I go. I'm going to give it one more day, but if I can't sleep and I need some stronger painkillers, that's all. Why would I tell them what really happened when it's clear that I want to be with you? I'm going to ask you a question, and you can. And I, I'm not asking you to give me an answer at all. I'm just going to ask you, somebody who's been very fair mm-hmm. with this, is he done? Is he? T- yeah. 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 Um, yeah. That's that's too much just stark evidence now is he done forever i don't know you know you know he goes away and time passes and he comes back and people are like hey didn't he do that thing Mm. um but you know i mean look uh, the big thing for us was like man what a fan amazing black actor we have like like He's new on the scene. I mean, relatively new. Oh, and you yeah. can always tell he, he's one of the best in the business. Maybe, oh, oh, yeah. You know, he, he is pretty much inheriting the mantle of Denzel Washington. So to have this happen is, is, is tragic. Uh, and then, you know, boom, boom, boom. He's getting the big pictures. He's, he's already in the, the big bad for the Marvel Universe. Mm-hmm. But then the Marvel Universe is kind of folding in on itself anyway. Like, you know, what they used him for with Kang is such that... It's a like, well, if Kane goes away, people are not going to be upset like they might have been if those movies had been. <clears throat> well, no, that's true. So, well, yeah. But, so, you know, I mean, he, he's he's losing out at a time when things were kind of going away anyway. And uh, but like, like for the foreseeable future, yeah, I think he's done. Well, here's the sad thing about it. Uh, I don't know if they would have done with Kang. People are already talking about it, it wasn't working, but you know what would have happened had none of this had had none of this been reported, or he had never done any of these. Yeah, yeah, these like, things like, like he, he had never done. Uh, and, a, and, a, and another multiverse, you know, yeah, another yeah, yeah. another variant. Or something. Like I said, another multiverse. He never committed any of these uh, these accusations. Um, even if they did decide to like do something different with the character, mm-hmm. even if they decide to take it in a different direction. He'd be going out on top. Now, this being public, it's a part of what you think of when you think of him. Yeah. Like, not being public means, as an actor, you can disappear into a role. Yeah. And, and yeah. there's no other baggage attached to it. Yeah. No, very true. 